categorizing electromagnetic radiation. And for the first part, we're going to complete this graphic here. And this graphic is called the electromagnetic spectrum. It is all of the radiation or light radiation that exists in the universe. And the smallest of that radiation is actually gamma rays, gamma rays. So they have a very short or small wavelength. Uh, and if you have a small wavelength, you actually have a high frequency. And if you have a high frequency, you have high energy, a large energy. Um, next, and it's a little bit larger than gamma rays, are x-rays. Okay, these. So if gamma rays are here, x-rays are a little bit bigger here. And if we move over and go a little bit bigger, we have ultraviolet light, ultraviolet light. And ultraviolet light's here. Now, ultraviolet light is um, just next to, if we look at the visible color spectrum that we can see, ultraviolet light means it's light that has a little bit bigger energy or more energy than violet light. Uh, and here we have uh, visible, light. So visible lights right in the middle of the spectrum. This is what we can see as humans. <clears throat> now a little bit bigger, so with wavelengths that are bigger than visible light, are infrared light. Uh, this is light that's heat. It's heat in the world around us. Anything that's warm is giving off infrared light. And that's what we call radiation when we talk about uh, heat. It's actually infrared. Uh, a little bit bigger than that are microwaves. Uh, micro actually uh, means small, but microwaves actually aren't that small. Microwaves can be centimeters long. And bigger than microwaves are radio waves. Radio waves are the biggest electromagnetic waves uh, that we have. Uh, and they have a large wavelength. Um, but that means if they have a large wavelength, they have actually have a small uh, or low frequency and they have small energy or low energy, small or low energy. Okay, and actually let's call this low energy. And a low, low frequency. And I'm gonna change this up here, short, small, uh, low, they all mean the same thing. Low. And now let's go to the next uh, page here and let's look at gamma rays and gamma rays are very 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 high energy uh, And we use that energy for many different purposes and one of the purposes that we use that energy for is to sterilize food to keep food uh, clean and safe for us to eat uh, We also use that uh, to kill bacteria And we use that to kill the bacteria in food, but also to kill the bacteria on objects that we might need to use. And gamma rays are also used to treat cancer. So if you have cancer, um, or if you know somebody who's had cancer, they might have actually had uh, gamma rays used on them to treat the cancer. X-rays are also used to sterilize food. They're also used uh, to kill and uh, Bacteria and viruses, they're also used to treat cancer, uh, but we actually also use them to see inside the human body. Okay, uh, ultraviolet light uh, we use to kill bacteria uh, and viruses, um, we can use it also to sterilize food. Um, and that's about it. Ultraviolet light is high energy light that we use most often to kill bacteria and viruses that might be in our food or in other places. Uh, visible light is what we use uh, to see with our eyes. So if you look around you in the world, uh, visible light uh, allows you to see the objects. Visible light comes from the sun uh, the sun comes, sends light to our planet, uh, and those light rays bounce off of the objects around us and uh, come into our, our eyes, and that's how we can see them. 
Infrared radiation um, is used uh, to heat objects, so it's a source of uh, its warmth, its heat. Uh, if we go over to microwaves, microwaves are used in communications. Our cell phones actually send microwaves uh, from antennas to the cell phone and from cell phones to cell phone towers. Uh, and radio waves are also used uh, to communicate. So we have, if you notice, you'll see some interesting um, connections. And actually, I forgot one more. Uh, to heat food, we use microwaves to heat food. Okay, let me see if we missed anything. Um, no, okay, so if we look over here, microwaves and radio waves are both used to communicate. Microwaves are special in that we use them to heat food. Uh, infrared radiation is heat, so we use this to heat objects. Visible light we use to see. These over here that are small wavelengths, they have high energy. We use them to sterilize food, to kill bacteria and viruses. Okay? And x-rays and gamma rays we actually use to treat cancer. And x-rays are special because if you've broken a bone in your body, we can use them to see inside the body. Okay? Uh, please use this video to complete this activity.